Welcome to a brief history of where we explore the comic book origins of characters appearing on the big screen in a short amount of time. As comic books often are, there are many different incarnations and versions of a character, but today we'll be focusing on Christopher Smith, the Peacemaker, who originally appeared in Charlton Comics, now acquired by DC Comics, will be appearing in James Gunn's The Suicide Squad, and who is going to be portrayed by professional wrestler turned actor John Cena. Christopher Smith, the original Peacemaker, made his first appearance in Charlton Comics The Fightin' Five, issue 40, in the chapter introducing the Peacemaker in November 1966 and was created by magazine writer and comic book scripter Joe Gill and the comic book artist Pat Boyette. Peacemaker is a superhero and a soldier who loves peace so much he's willing to kill for it. Originally, he was a pacifist and a diplomat who used strictly non lethal weapons, although over time he developed into a more violent vigilante willing to make sacrifices for the greater good. As part of an assignment, the President of the United States of America personally sent Smith to Geneva in order to stop a border war being provoked by a mysterious entity between two South American nations. What they knew was that the arms dealer was a man called Emil Borg who had been selling weapons to both nations and Christopher began an inquiry to look deeper into it. After arriving in Geneva, Smith got into a car where he was further briefed by his secretary, Miss Blair, about a man called Emil Borg who had agents inside of two countries who were at war with each other, sabotaging buildings and bridges. Meanwhile, Bork is standing on a cliff waiting for Smith's limo to pass by and orders his men to shoot. Bork's men fired explosive bullets knocking the car off the road. Then, Bork's men approached the car, took out a briefcase that was inside the car and opened it, releasing a deadly gas, killing both henchmen and causing Bork to flee in a car. A day later, at an embassy dinner, Smith encountered Bork, who was attending the peace conference as an advisor. Later, in Smith's retreat in the Swiss Alps, Smith went to his armory and picked out a weapon, new attire, a jetpack to use in confronting Bork. As a self identified pacifist, Smith was reluctant to use weapons. Next, Smith flew out to Bork's residence to confront him. As he was in range of the residence, Bork's men opened fire but they did no damage as Smith was wearing a protective body armor. One of Bork's men aimed a rocket launcher at Smith and demanded to know who he was before he killed him. Smith introduced himself as the peacemaker and used a laser ray in his helmet to melt the rocket launcher instead of hitting the man. When Smith learned from one of the henchmen that Bork was fleeing in his jet bomber, he flew to pursue Bork who fired a missile at him and unable to dodge, Peacemaker shot at the missile with his laser ray. However, Peacemaker was caught in the blast zone, thus ending the debut issue of Peacemaker on a cliffhanger. The Christopher Smith incarnation of Peacemaker will appear in James Gunn's The Suicide Squad and will be portrayed by professional wrestler turned actor John Cena. This peacemaker, also known as Christopher Smith, is a violent extremist who believes in achieving peace at any cost, no matter how many people he has to kill for it. He is also a member of the second Task Force X strike team, sent on a mission to Cordo Maltese. Let me know if you are excited for the new Suicide Squad coming out August 6th, hashtag release the year cut.